Hello everybody! Today I'm going to try out the new Cricut Design Android Beta app I've managed to get hold of. So let's have a look. So it's pretty similar to the normal design space at the moment. Click on the new project. You have to use two fingers to make the screen smaller. Or to see more. Uh, we've got images which takes you to your normal cartridges, different ones, go directly to the your cartridges, everything that's included in um, the access panels, you can add text, As normal, uh, I'm not sure where font is. Let's have a look, see if we can find that. Corrections, maybe edit. No, I'm not finding how to change the font at the moment. Change the colour. We shall work on that one, I think. Right. Um, under your actions, you've got your normal group, ungroup, attach, detach, weld, slice, flatten, unflatten, duplicate. Isolate letters and hide contour. Let's add some shapes, shall we? And go into the layers to change your colours. Now the other day when I was playing with this, um I could only add two of each shape and then it wouldn't show up on the actual screen here. It would show up in the layers panel but it wouldn't show up on the screen so it probably just a little glitch so hopefully it won't happen again anyway. Let's change this one, let's make something, let's make it quick. Cookie Monster or something. And just using the normal arrows that you'll get in the normal design space on your laptop. It's okay yours so far. Uh, let's change that white because it's an eye. And then to duplicate, we go to actions as normal and copy. So we need two of that one as well. And you can move them into the play position. Probably it'd be easier to resize, one, uh, duplicate once it's been resized. Now that's behind, so let's find how we bring it forward. Normal arrange, of course. Right, so we need another circle for the mouth. Uh, need it smaller. We also need it black. And we need to slice it to 
make a mouth shape. Now you need to highlight the... Let's move it down. Highlight both of the, the shapes to slice. That's normal. You can only slice two objects at a time, two images. Otherwise it doesn't work. Slice. And that works as normal. And then we have a kind of cookie monster. <laughs> Today I'm going to um, show you something else. Let's save him as Cookie Monster. I'll show you something else. I want to cut something else. So how do we go back to the beginning? Um, I want to do the Valentine's gift box. So we go to images. It's a Cricket quick it, quick it image. It is in Access, I think it is, but I've actually bought the image, if we can find it. It's a little heart gift box, which is perfect for Valentine's. I'm going to make a little gift box with put some chocolates and bits in for my little girl. This one here. So you selected it, click insert, to resize it, pretty simple. You can see the width of it for the measurements and the height. I'm going to cut it on um, A4 paper so we can make it about that big in total, I think. Um, that's about the right size. So I'm going to save it now. Heart gift box. Normally, I'm not near my cricket, so it's not going to connect right now. But I will do it. I'll, I will carry on the video once it's cut. So normally, you go here, you continue, and connect the machine. And it connected. It connects to my Cricut Explore Air Two, no problems. So that's all sorted. So I shall see you again next time.